Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to repair a limp cord on your small engine. And this is what I mean by a limp cord. It's sticking out a bit like that and it will not retract inside the recoil. And as you're going to see in the video, it's very easy to fix this. Now to start this repair, you need to remove the recoil on this engine here. There are three 10 millimeter bolts, two at the top, one at the bottom. And I'll remove these three bolts with my impact. And here's the rope again. You can see it's sticking out about six to eight inches. Now to start this easy repair, all you need to do is pull the cord a bit. Now you might notice on your recoil that you have a hole like this. If not, you can heat up a screwdriver and burn a hole through to make a hole. Now you can use a pair of needle nose pliers to grab the rope. And now you need to put it into this hole. This will allow you to go around the bumps here or the parts of the recoil where the rope may not necessarily fit through. And now turn counterclockwise. So I'm just gonna turn counterclockwise one turn on this one. If the rope was out further, I would go two turns counterclockwise. And with this recoil here, one turn counterclockwise fixed the problem. So it was an easy fix for today. Now if you did this and the rope was still limp, you would probably need to replace the recoil spring inside over here. But oftentimes you don't need to replace the spring, you just need to do what I showed you today to get the rope nice and firm against the recoil like this. And as long as the rope comes back in nice and tight like that, do not tighten it up even more because if you tighten it up too much, you can end up breaking the spring. That's why I only turned it one turn counterclockwise. And now what you need to do is reinstall your recoil. And now what I do is I finish off the tightening by hand. Just use common sense and put it on fairly tight. So that's all there is to fixing a limp cord guys. It's that easy. And another tip guys to prevent a limp cord is when you do replace the rope, make sure you use the proper size. If you use a rope that's too big, the cord may not go back in all the way and therefore it's going to be sitting outside the recoil limp. So thanks again for watching guys. Make sure to subscribe. You can also follow me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. Make sure you sign up to these social media outlets because you can see extra tips from day to day and different pictures that I post on there from my shop every day. So have yourselves a great day guys.